Hi, this is Ken Urban, and this is a um, CSC video. Um, what I want to talk about briefly is I have a project here open in CodeBlocks, and I want to just like use this IDE to add a file to the project, just so it's, it's more convenient for me. Um, of course, I could use a separate editor and, and, and find where the file is in the directory, stuff like that, but I just want to do it real quick. Um, so I'm going to have a data file in this program called, um, how about, uh, well, we'll talk about points, so let's call it points.text. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over to point, and I'm going to right-click, and I right-clicked, you can't see that, but I did right-click, um, and uh, there's add files. You know, what it does is it pops up the containing folder that has it, and you can see that here's all of my stuff that's in the project. And I can, again, right-click, go to New. If you can't see it on the screen, it's, it's New, and then Text Document. And I'll just call it um, Data. It's already got the .txt at the end. Um, all right, so now I have this data.txt in here. i got to select it again. You have to kind of select it twice to make sure the file name is here. I'm going to open it and um, select the targets. I'm going to leave debug and release selected. Click OK. And now I have point, header, and others. And I have data.txt. One more piece we have to do is that uh, when I open it, oh, I've already set it on my machine. When you open it for the first time, it'll ask where you want to edit it. And you can choose the internal code blocks editor for that. Okay? So when you open it, it'll ask what editor. Choose the internal code blocks editor because it's a text file. And, and the internal code blocks editor works very fine with text files. Okay, thanks. Bye.